Chef Andy Lotto from Josephine's on 12th is helping the Nashville Sounds kick off their new season over at First Tennessee Park by bringing over a pop-up dish for the night at the band box. He will be serving simple but delicious sausage and peppers and onions on a hoagie roll. Oh, he's in the rest of, in the kitchen now with the recipe. Good to have you with us. You did this last year and it was a great success. Yeah, it's a lot of fun. I mean, it's always fun to be at the baseball stadium. Always fun to be at the band box. So we're going to kick off this year with some sausage and pepper sausage that we're making at Josephine. Uh -huh. We just sort of started browning off. Recipes available on your website. Okay. All righty. So we get it nice and brown on the side here. And, you know, I always look forward to baseball season because, you know, as far as food goes mm -hmm. it's like soft shell crabs are always coming right around baseball season yeah. so i know that our menu at josephine's about to flip over and I'm always super excited to be out with the sounds and, and to be out at the band box i mean this this chef pop-up series that they have uh -huh. super great i mean a lot of fun to get people out at the stadium have some drinks at the you know the little band box bar and then come over and and have some great things that you know sometimes chefs that get out of their restaurant they can do things that are a little more baseball friendly. Yeah. <laughs> so we're, we're going with the sausage and peppers. Good. Once they're nice and brown here, All right. we're just going to pop them over here into this real basic tomato sauce and let them finish cooking. Okay. So just any uh, tomato sauce that you might happen to like? I mean, just go to the grocery store. We don't need to spend a whole lot of time on the tomato sauce. Okay. All righty. So once we got a little bit of brown in the bottom there, so we we'll add some of the peppers and onions. I love to cook the peppers and onions in the fat okay. from the sausage. So we'll just add those right there. Give them a quick stir and mm -hmm. watch right, them cook down. Here. I have some cooked up here. Okay. And then another thing that's really important, the sausage obviously important, the peppers and onions, a little bit of garnish, but the bread mm -hmm. is super important. So this bread is actually coming from our friends at Interasian Market in oh, Nolensville okay. yeah. Pike. Uh -huh. So they do their banh mi's on it and I thought, well, I love their banh mi's. What would happen if we put a sausage in there too? So just split the roll a little bit uh -huh. and add a little bit of tomato sauce on okay. the bottom and then kind of give it a nice little scoop mm -hmm. a little bit of a high wire act there <laughs> getting it into the bun so it's, is this uh, what else are you putting with this when you're out there on uh thursday so we've got this we've got the sausage and a little bit of peppers and onions on top mm -hmm. and then just for fun because i don't know that you can do baseball and hot dogs or sausages without some apple pie brought from Josephine, brought this oh, little look at there. apple cobbler and ice cream that's currently on our menu. Uh -huh. Also, I feel like you need to load up the sausage and peppers. It's gotta <laughs> Ooh, look be, at that. It's gotta yeah, be a meal. Yeah. There you go, there, that is a fantastic meal right there. Good stuff, and so you're gonna be out there coming up, uh, let me put it right there. Next Thursday uh -huh. for opening day. I know Sunday was a big day, mm -hmm. a big sellout with the, the yeah, Rangers in town. Yeah, with that Rangers uh, game. And so, and the band box too, they were telling me the other day, yeah, the band box is a great place to be because you can go socialize, yeah. check out the game every now and then. You will find this recipe online at newschannel5.com under the Talk of the Town section and catch Chef Andy Little at the Sounds opener Thursday, April 4th, first pitch is at 635. Thank you again for being with us. Thanks today. for having me.